Oh man, that's a nice fish. Oh my god. Hey guys, my name is Chris and you're watching WC Fishing. What is up guys, Chris here. Uh, so it's been about a week since I last filmed. Uh, since then, I visited my brother up in Ithaca, caught some large with bass and some smallies. But we are here guys, as I promised. We are at the end, Montauk Point. How big would you say this is? Like a six, That's seven. That's a nice eating one. Five pound? Good size. Five pound fish, you think? Yeah. Alright. It's not quite my PB fish, but it's very close. It's still a very nice fish. That's a good fish. Yeah, it's a nice fish. Alright, let's catch some more. First fish of the day. Oh man, that's a nice fish. What did you say that was? A little less than 20? Uh, a little less than 20 pounds? Uh, that's a big fish. Nice catch. See it out there? There he is, there he is.
got a little serpent. <laughs> uh, all right, guys, this is the fourth fish of the day for all of us. Nice, small striper. Great fish. I'm gonna throw it back. All right, let's get the release. Two false albacore, or Benita, we're not sure what they are. And I just caught a nice uh, false albacore as well. Uh, right now it's in here. You guys can see that. Oh my gosh. Alright guys, so this is my uh, third fish of the day. My first ever false albacore tuna. Uh, as you can see, you guys think this is about five pounds? Five pounds or so? Man, I've been wanting to catch one of these for a very long time. Look how beautiful that is, the coloration on its back. Oh my god. Got that fish. Alright, great. Let's see what else we can catch.
funny shit and get the monster out. Oh, you're gonna need two hands for that. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, right? <laughs> Alright guys, so uh, we just got back. A uh, good five hours out in the water. Um, so all in all we caught, let's see, how many fish did we catch? Well, we released a few fish. I think we released like one, no, two bluefish and a uh, false albacore, but here we have uh, three false albacore, four blues, and a striped bass. So that's like, you know, it's eight fish. So yeah, we, uh, we caught 11 fish in total, which is really great. I also caught um, my biggest bluefish ever, and I caught my first ever false albacore tuna, which was really great because that's been a target species my entire life. And probably the biggest thing is that I also caught the biggest fish in my life, which was the false albacore tuna. So um, that was also really great. All right, so uh, right now, Peter here, first mate, is um, cleaning and cutting up the fish. We got some blues right here. Just gonna fillet it. Alright, so we're about to check the stomach contents of the fish. We can see what he's been eating. Is this video going to be allowed on YouTube? Oh, Many things have been allowed. A oh. Rolex. A Rolex. <laughs> <laughs> uh, There's nothing there. It's pretty lean. You must have been hungry. Yep. Let's see what we got. Pretty lean. Now, if it was your first bass, you'd have to eat the heart, you know. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's actually it's his first bass. Yeah, I know. It's his <laughs> first bass. Mike makes his first now. <laughs> so you get the courage of the bass. Isn't it the same thing for the tuna? If yep. it's your first tuna, you gotta eat the heart. Nothing. Wait, technically you should have eaten the heart of the, uh, those, uh, what were they? The, um, false albacore. Except up in there. They don't always count. Does he eat it? Oh, is that the stomach? Nothing. Empty. Empty stomach. Hungry. Yeah. Oh man. Wow. Actually, he probably regurgitated it on the way up. Yeah. Empty stomach. And there it goes. All right, guys. Uh, so that pretty much sums it up for today's video. Uh, it was pretty eventful. Caught some new species. New biggest fish of my life. Uh, as of the next video, I'm gonna do. Not really sure. I'm probably going to continue my school series, you know, post little vids here and there. And before I forget, uh, I really want to give a shout out to the double header, the boat we just went on. Uh, Jim, the captain, and his first mate, Peter, were excellent. And if you guys want to catch uh, the same stuff we did, the uh, false albacore, stripers, blues, or even sharks and tuna, they also do offshore stuff, give them a call. They're really great. Alright guys, so this pretty much sums up for today's video. Um, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you on my next video.